because you're counting on him to make the right reads and give the ball where it's supposed to go. And he did on that play. Carl Lawson, former Bengal, in on the stop. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. Being chased out left. He finds Robinson. And that's going to be another first down as the tackle made at the Jets' 25-yard line. From the gun, Madden. Over the middle, hauled in by Shark. And they'll get this down to the 10. Those are the kinds of plays right there that show you why he's the number three man in the NFL in terms of receiving yards. It also tells you there's a full combination of what he's got going in his game. You name it, from route running to catching the football, that's why he's able to produce those types of numbers. Touchdown! Carter Landry, touchdown number 22 on the season. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And Charles, the way touchdowns have come so fast and furious for both sides in this thing, it's starting to feel a little bit more like maybe a tennis match in a football game. Yeah, I like your description there. Maybe we're sitting in a nice royal box watching this type of a game. But let's face it, right now, the way it's going back and forth, it's going to come down to who can get a stop. And out across midfield, down to the 45. A big play that time through the air. 30 yards. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield. It's first and 10 from the 45. Here's a throw over the middle. It's taken in by his tight end. And he's corralled, but not before getting it inside the 35. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. Operating from the gun. Madden forced out to his left. And this a leaping effort, but it's knocked away and incomplete. After the incomplete pass, here now is second and ten. They'll look to throw again. And he's going to get this down near the 20-yard line. And this has been a nice answer to the touchdown drive against them a few minutes ago because they've come out and reestablished the tempo. A nice throw there, and they're putting together a very strong drive as a response. That'll be caught right side. Chenault with it. Touchdown, Jaguars! LaVisca Chenault. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And the ledger for them so far looks pretty good, doesn't it? It certainly does. Touchdown, touchdown, touchdown. <laughs> Not sure it can be much better than that. They've got to feel very good about the groove that they're in at this stage of the game. And he's going to get this one across the 30-yard line. Solid way to start the drive. 13 yards, picking up the first. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. A reminder, once we hit halftime, as we do all season, we'll send it down to Jonathan Coachman in Orlando. He'll have all the stats and scores from games in progress around the NFL. The best multitasker in the business, the coach. And they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get completions, and they're taking advantage of it. And now here's a deep shot that's complete. Touchdown, Jaguars! Marvin Jones hitting double digits with his 10th touchdown of the season. And the Jaguars are able to... All right, the offense back on the field here. Let's see what they can do on this play. Throwing on first down. Madden steps away to his left. And the coverage terrific there as that's knocked down and incomplete. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. Off play action. Madden. They'll roll him out right. And this winds up a gain of four to the 41. And they'll need to get to the 35 if they want to keep this drive going on third down. Oh, he didn't spike it. He faked it. They'll be taken down. The Jets get in there for the sack. Carl Lawson in there to get him, and that is sack number six now for him on the year. The Jaguars now will use the last of their timeouts as the clock will stop with just under 30 seconds to go in the first half. 
Buying time to his left. This is caught inside the 15. Touchdown. DJ Shark, his 17. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And they were terrific in the first half, built up a sizable lead, and it's just been cut into a bit following the opening drive score on the other side. But this is a unit that has to be itching to get the football again. You can say that again. They've got to be pretty eager because, let's face it, they've had to sit through halftime then sit on the sidelines and watch that drive. So you can bet that they're saying, let's get on with this. we got to go out there and get some more points. One play has him up past the 40 already and another first and 10. Rolling to his right, to the right side and complete to Landry. They'll contain him to just four, second down. And Charles, you think about this offense, and it's kind of a tricky time of the season because you're 14-0, looking to see this one out to the end, but you start to run into situations where guys are getting a little banged up, maybe could use some time sharing, some time on the bench just to rest. How do you approach the rest of this regular season? I'm telling you, you don't ask the easy stuff, do you? I mean, you created a heck of a situation there, and actually, you didn't create it. You presented it, and you're exactly right. It is tricky because your eye has to be on the ultimate prize, which is the Super Bowl. That's paramount. But at the same time, how much fun would it be to go down as one of the all-time great teams and join the 1972 Dolphins as the only undefeated team to win a Super Bowl? And now we get into the psychology of the whole thing because a lot of teams with a two-score lead in the third quarter, they almost become defensive with their offense, just playing not to lose. I think with the And this is caught. And he will get this into the end zone for a Jaguar touchdown. Jaguars come to the line to start their next drive. And they will start this drive with just terrible field position backed up inside their own five. But we have seen teams be bold here and take shots, right? Sometimes you go max protection, make it a one receiver route, and take your shot. And he's free going down the left side. It's a Are foot race. For this? Touchdown, Jaguars. James Robinson, his 25th touchdown. Tying him at Smith. Both offenses have been clicking in this one. A lot of points on the board. We'll see if that trend continues. On first and 10, it's ETN. And very little running room there. He did get a couple up to the 49. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. Looking to throw. Madden flushed out right. And he'll get it down here to the 43. play fake Madden on the move to his left he's got the first down here inside the 30 and this turns into a nice gain with a slide at the end on first down Madden connection made with Chanel and down Inside the 15, shy of the 10. Now a first and 10 at the 11. From the gun, Madden sliding out of the pocket. Right there, Chenault for the Jacksonville touchdown. LaVisca Chenault. His second TD of the game and 16th on the season. And the Jags are moving closer to a 15-0 record as they extend their lead here. 